This is the Riverhawk Report. We'll look back, we'll look ahead. We'll chow down on UMass Lowell Sports before we chow down on Turkey. And we have a full winter plate for you. Hockey and basketball in full bloom, some ups and some downs for each. We'll start with basketball, the women first. A tough Tuesday night at St. Mike's. A loss. 69-53 was the final. The game was tied midway through the second half, but St. Michael's got the job done. The loss should not obscure, though, a terrific performance by Brianna Wilson. She hit for 20 points and grabbed nine rebounds. The Riverhawks are one and three. They will host Southern New Hampshire on Sunday afternoon at the Costello Center. UMass Lowell men's basketball split their two games since last we talked. The Riverhawks defeated Philadelphia University Saturday 92-68. That, by the way, was a five-point game at the half, but the good guys took charge in the second half. Five Riverhawks in double digits. Depanjo Singh matched his career high with 24 points. Robbie Walton and Antonio Bivens each added 15. Akeem Williams threw in 14. Matt Welch hit for 13. Matters, though, did not go as smoothly on Tuesday night. UMass Lowell was defeated by St. Michael, 69-59, Singh and Welch each hit for 16, Williams added 10. The Riverhawks are 4-1, and one. they host Southern New Hampshire, that will be Sunday afternoon at the Costello Center, that is a 4 p.m. start. In Hockey East, you need to get points every weekend, and the UMass Lowell Hockey Riverhawks are doing just that. They split a pair of games this past weekend, they were beaten at UNH Friday night, and stepped up with a terrific bounce-back performance on Saturday night at the Songus Center. The Riverhawks shot down and shot out UMass Amherst the final 4-0. The Riverhawks got goals from David Valerani to break a scoreless deadlock midway through the second period. Tim Corcoran, the first of his career, Chad Ruedel, and Riley Wentmore. Between the pipes, Doug Carr was solid. He picked up the first shutout of his career. He stopped 16 shots. He called it a team shutout. The Hockey Riverhawks are back in action Friday afternoon, a 4 p.m. start. They host Alabama Huntsville at the Songa Center. UMass Lowell Cross Country at the NCAA Division II National Championships. The Riverhawks finished 20th in the country. They were the top finishers among East Region schools. The top individual for the Riverhawks, Greg Wilson. The Chelmsford native finished 57th in the country. Chow down. Have a terrific Thanksgiving. And that's the Riverhawk Report.